Okay, it, it's time. I'm done waiting. It, it is time. This is it. All right, we're gonna get a four star here. It's gonna be very nice, very good, cool. Thank you. Uh, so what four star is it? Obviously, it's gonna be that thing, which is gonna give us two masterless star glitter. Oh, and would you look at that? I have the perfect amount to do a multi on this banner to get Nilu finally. I am. Why you? Of all characters, you. All right, maybe your C6 will change my opinion of you. But as of now, it is not. And am I gonna get a second four star in here? Come on, cause we could literally be. All right, come, what? are you joking? I do what? I Okay, I thought we were gonna get you know a second four star. We got that guy who pulls in man Okay, y you gotta do me like that. I don't even know what to do Okay, so today is gonna be more relaxed videos. So yes, I literally got shafted so hard on Nilu I switched games and I've been playing Honkai Star Rail for a little bit and I kind of like it Like I really like it. It's not bad. And honestly, this is the best part this little girl runs the fastest out of everybody on my team. This is actually the... <laughs> I love this. This is amazing. I, I, This will be my main character, all right? I don't know. I wanted the little dragon girl, all right? I wanted the dragon girl. I want to just destroy th this, this little Bailu, whatever. A, th a couple things that I've noticed with this game is that it is extremely free to play or not it's more free to play friendly than genshin all right let's start off with that that's what i'll say yeah so here we have basically our beginner wish and genshin which we didn't get a guaranteed five star on however in this game you get to summon on this discounted every single time until you get a five star i'm pretty sure maybe you even get a five star beforehand and you're still able to summon i don't know this is actually it's a little bit of a spit in the face to all the genshin players and then not to mention that they have uh, like let's just look at the five stars up here 13 five stars wait what oh that's four stars sorry <laughs> okay maybe messed up a little this is seven five stars in this game we did not have seven five stars on the standard banner for us we had jean barbara yes barbara's the main <laughs> I'm gonna leave it in. We have Jean, Barbara, Deluc, uh, we have Mona also, and then we had Kaching. I'm not forgetting anybody, obviously. Uh, Barbara's just the five star we're talking about, right? So we have five, and then we have two more that were added to the standard banner. And on this game, we automatically have seven. So, you know, I don't know if they're trying to copy Genshin to make sure that we still have seven, but this is every single type plus like doubles. We have doubles of these ones. These guys are doubles. I, you know, whatever, but like why and then they also have a login event which i think is what we had in the beginning of genshin also we have a login event 10 summons for some reason it goes for 40 days it's until the end of this update so yeah and then we also have this that's pretty good because basically if i get to trailblaze level 15 i get my five star which is really good i do like that that is really good for most of the time and then we also have this now this is basically our you know test runs but the good thing about this is you're basically able to see everything that the character has to offer from what i can tell you can see her just do her damage i don't think there's elemental reactions that are important in this game from what i've seen like i there's no elemental reactions it's really just hey you need this certain element to defeat the shield yeah, this is still just going to be the funniest thing ever. Why does she run so fast? But yeah, I have, I've been doing the story a little bit, you know, uh, I'm about to go get experimented on, which is, you know, whatever you, you do you, uh, and, oh, uh, yeah, I forgot that she had a giant claw. Why? But the thing is with this game, it's not open world. So yeah, this girl let, may be able to run super fast. Uh, they also have a girl named March 7th. So why nobody will ever know but they do and yeah overall i like this game weird thing is everybody has a coat don't ask but everybody has a coat if you're in this game you're wearing a coat whether you like it or not i should probably level up these characters Ooh. 
Oh my. Wait. Oh, and they automatically... Listen, this is literally just Genshin Impact, but just different. Okay. Ascension materials needed. Okay, let's let's do this. Let's ascend my guy. Oh. Okay, that's, that's a lot. But... Ascend. Okay, we need level 15. Okay, you could have told me that before. Before I wasted all of my resources there. Uh, and I haven't figured out where we use our resin yet. Uh, I, like I said... Yeah, it's a, it's a little weird. Yeah, this is the wholesome character that I want, not some TikTok e-girl, you know, taking pictures of herself, all right? And then also, our character is completely cringe. Every single time you, wear, like, use his burst, which is what I'm going to call it for us, for us Genshin people, we know what the term burst means. Nice. Listen. All right, okay. But whenever he uses his burst, he goes, Rules are meant to be broken! But, fun thing is, this guy already has more voice lines than Aether and Genshin Impact. What are you grabbing, bro? Is this literally- Wait, isn't that the Genshin Impact animation? They did, obviously, is take Genshin as a game, alter it in a lot of ways, but then they sort of kept the art style-ish. Sort of, you can tell when something's basically from Genshin in this game. Like, the pity, the rates, all of this stuff is from Genshin. Every single bit of it. But, I mean, hey, it's it's a fun game. It's a completely different play style. You know, a completely turn-based game. Seems pretty fun. If they add PvP, I'll quit. Uh, just, I don't like PvP gotchas, man. It, it, it always ruins it for me. I just don't like PvP. So, yeah. So, yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. Just wanted to make a quick, like, hey, yo, I'm playing Star Rail. And, uh... The reason being is because I got so shafted on Nilu that I just started playing Star Rail instead. Which, you know, is kind of counterintuitive because I'm playing another Hoyoverse game. Yeah, probably should have chosen, like, something else. But, hey, they just came out. So, yeah. This is my first impressions on Star Rail. Yeah, it seems like a pretty good game. Bye!